Welcome to Eq Human Impact Individuals, a series where we talk to inspiring innovators who make a real impact. Today we are talking to someone who is transforming waste sorting and materials recovery in India, and we are speaking with Mr. Sandeep Singh, the CEO of Ishitwa Robotic System. Sir, can you please introduce yourself? Okay, my name is Sandeep Singh, and I'm CEO of Ishitwa Robotic Systems. We make sorting solution for any resource recovery. It could be plastic, metal, glass, paper. and we enable circularity for uh, the recyclers of india and the world so what exactly are you showcasing here at prs since it's a plastic recycling show uh, one of the real challenge uh, the industry is facing is that how to get a purified feed stock so what we are showcasing here couple of solution one is where a small aggregator how he can use our automation solution to uh, get a purified bale and supply it to the recycler so that recycling quality is enhanced and also uh, the it can, he can scale uh, the total recovery of the material and also we are showcasing a, a, a purity check automation purity check system which is called ishitwa analyzer so uh, the flakes which is being produced by the recyclers it can be autonomously tested and it will uh, create the ppm level purity report Uh, so that you know the quality uh, parameters are standardized and the brands have uh, you know easy to uh, find it easy to accept the recycled content so how did your company begin it's a group of mad engineers uh, what industry calls us mad engineers coming from the dump yard so uh, we were uh, cynic about solving the problem of waste for our country and uh, it was started by my partner jitesh uh, uh, he was he was a techie he wanted to uh, create technology for india i got in touch with him we saw the opportunity in the waste industry and the recycling industry and we uh, started creating the sorting solutions because we realized segregation and recovery is the real bottleneck to the circularity and that is what we started focusing on what were the initial challenges that you faced uh, you know misbelief i would say uh, from every side even uh, when you when you used to hire, uh, try to uh, hire uh, uh, good quality engineers uh, you know we were working in waste we were working yeah. in uh, a lot of uh, contaminated environment and uh, etc so it was very difficult to convince them that there is a bright future ahead uh, and also the customers you know uh, believing that this kind of technology can be built out of here in india was very surprising for many of the customers i'm not talking about uh, the developed world uh, companies also indian companies were very surprised that some such, such kind of technology can be built here so i would like to know that how does your systems work like what are the processes Okay, so what what we have done, uh, we uh, have uh, you know uh, algorithm. If I in simple word, I would like to put it as a machine learning algorithm, which identifies the material at a very high speed. It is trained on billions and billions and billions of waste classified images. Every day we are sorting more than thousand ton of waste using our machine. So imagine out what is the volume of data we are capturing and analyzing every day. On a very high speed, it can identify the material not only polymer, color. can also and it find whether it is food grade cosmetic grade or oil grade so you know we ensure that you know only food grade material is going for food grade pellet making only cosmetic grade is going for cosmetic making all the that kind of circularity challenges which was uh, you know as we have recycling industry faced we have solved using ai so like what new innovations or product lines are you planning to launch in future so uh, we have filed uh, almost 18 patents we are protecting our technology in india in uh, the developed world as well as uh, many parts of the geographies and that has been my area of expertise before ishitwa so uh, it is uh, uh, we are covering a full gamut of solutions which we are building it is related to uh, uh, the plastic recovery metal recovery glass recovery as well as purity and so it's a it's a well spread out if i talk uh, what makes ishitwa better than others like better than your competitors so we we understand the requirement of the industry very well Uh, you know uh, there are uh, many sorting solutions using sensor based systems or different different ways but utilized to uh, you know uh, do the purity enhancement or the segregation but what really recycler wants that in depth understanding we put a lot of effort in that so most of the solution are customized or ai customized to address those problems there what is needed to create a food grade pellet what is needed to create a cosmetic grade pellet what is needed to create a good fiber all that understanding is inbuilt with our uh, ai solutions uh, beyond environmental benefits what social or community impact does your work create we are we are uh, see the real bottleneck in the circular value chain is segregation 
there is enormous waste is being generated in our urban areas as well as rural areas there is a very good quality recycling companies are getting built uh, you know in the, in the further ahead of the value chain but th that is the link because our segregation is uh, you know a lot uh, you know manual uh, or uh, not even existing in many uh, part of the cities if we unlock that piece there will be significant uh, job employment in collection there will be significant job employment possibility in recycling industry and that is what we see happening uh, wherever our machines are going there's a lot of unlocking of employment opportunities are happening so how do you see the future of india in terms of recycling there's only one way to go i mean in last 2 3 years the recycling industry has given phenomenal uh, advancements and we have been also a central role of achieving uh, that phenomenal advancement in the recycling industry but uh, the kind of uh, pellets india is producing uh, you go to any trade shows whether yeah. it is in euro whether it in the us you'll see indian recyclers are the prominent uh, you know face there because the kind of quality we are able to produce here so uh, there is only one way to go we leaps and bounds we need to keep build uh, on it we need to convert our waste into resource and uh, it's, it's huge opportunity next 10 years will be very different for this industry the way there's only one way to go i can say uh could you share some examples where ishitva solutions uh, help recycling industries part yeah uh, there could be many uh, uh, i'll if you want me to pick one i would uh, pick uh, one use case where uh, there was a uh, in one uh, particular line uh, the customer was doing uh, it was an aggregation center he was used to collect uh, the pt loose bottles etc and used to create bales uh, he he used to manage 2 to 3 ton per a day using almost 40 50 uh, labor and uh, even when the bales are created it was uh, dispatched to the recyclers he used to get a lot of debit notes about the quality uh, you know uh, parameters etc now uh, he has adopted our automation solution the same facility is doing 18 to 30 ton per day so it's 9x to 15x volume he is increased labor because uh, but he is increased labor to for 45 to increase to about 50 60 but he is producing 9x and 10x 15x and the quality is such that in the market people call their material a zero ppm material ppm is a parts per million which is defined as a uh, norm uh, it's a terminology used for quality standards so he has achieved that uh, reputation In, in the market, so uh, it's, it's amazing what we have done for uh, yeah. that purpose. So I'll start with the rapid fire round right now. Okay. Uh, one word that defines your company. Passion. Can you summarize your company's vision in one word? You can use more than one word. We sought to create value. Okay. If Ishitu were an element of nature, what would it be? Like rather than company. oxygen. Who is your favorite between entrepreneur or buyers? Entrepreneur. One message for our human audience. So it's just dream big, dream big, and there is nothing which is not not possible. We need to uh, just keep pushing ourselves, and uh, what is required is great. Uh, nothing, uh, nobody creates value in a single night or single day. It's yeah. a long, long journey. You just need to be passionate about it and keep Thank working. You so much. Thank you. Thank you for sharing your journey. Thank you. To all our listeners, follow Ecumen for more such innovative stories. Until then, stay tuned, stay driven, and keep innovating.